Play It Again was written by Dallas Davidson and Ashley Gorley and is a hit single for country artist Luke Bryan. The song's in the key of B, but we'll put a capo on the fourth fret for the acoustic and the lead guitar and we'll play key of G chords. The song's pretty straightforward on both guitars. We'll need to know four or five chords and one strum pattern to get through the whole thing. The rhythm guitar part uses four main chords and then one slight variation to a G chord that we'll learn for the bridge later on in the tutorial. So to start, let's just learn the four main chords. We're going to start with a C2, so that's middle finger, third fret of the A string above the capo, second fret of D, open G, third fret, third fret, and then we transition over to a standard G chord, which is really easy. Ring finger and pinky finger stay the same. And then we're going to move these two fingers down one string to a standard G. Then we have a standard D chord. Again, ring finger is going to stay right Let's here. start by learning the strum pattern for the introduction. Once we learn that, we'll kind of build all the other different slight variations to this progression on what we learn here. So we're going to start on the C2. Down, 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 up, up, down, 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 up, up, down, down. Down, 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 up, up, down, 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 up, up, down, down. So let's take a kind of zoomed in look on this C2 to G progression. Down, 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 up, and then this next up stroke is going to be when I'm transitioning my pointer and my middle finger. Up, down, then I'm on the G, down. So one more time. Down. Down, down, up, up, down, 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 down. One, two, one, two, three, four. All right, we're going to walk through the lead guitar part section by section. We're going to start with this, what I'll call kind of the pre-intro riff. Uh, you can hardly even hear it on the recording, but I'm going to teach it because if I were playing the song live, I think it'd be a cool way to start the song out. It's kind of a cool little lick. It sounds like this. So we've only got two strings in the mix here. We've got the D string and the G string. Pointer finger is going to be on the G string. Uh, we're going to start with a downstroke and a hammer on, up to four. Downstroke, downstroke. So when we get up here, it's going to be those looks. Down, down, up, up, down, down, hammer on, down. And then you get to the D. Uh, second time through, we're going to do this on the D chord. So we've got a standard D chord and we're going to get ready with our pinky to be up on the third fret. One, two, three, go. Here's the intro. 